Hello dear students, welcome to First Language English. It's a must practice worksheet number three. Here I have included some of the grammar and reference to context. Let us see the answer for them. Grammar section. In this, I have given you uh, the questions related to direct to indirect speech and combining the sentences by using so that not to to not only but also and no sooner than please make use of this In this first language english i have used no sooner than as soon as so the first question is before you the teacher entered the classroom all students stood up you need to use it in both no sooner than as well as as soon as likewise there are other two questions he got into the compartment the train started the thief saw the police the thief ran away let us see the answer combine the following sentences using no sooner than and as soon as the teacher entered the classroom. All students stood up. Second question. He got into the compartment. The train started. Let us see the answer. No sooner did the teacher enter the classroom than all the students stood up. Here, because he entered his past tense, you need to use did. After the date, the coming verb must be in the present form. That's why I have used enter. He got into compartment. The train started. No sooner did he enter the compartment than the train started. This is the way of using no sooner than. As soon as the teacher entered the classroom, all the students stood up. Let us see how to use the same by using as soon as. As soon as he entered the compartment, the train started. Next question. The thief saw the police. The thief ran away. So there are two sentences. Let us combine them. No sooner did the thief see the police than he ran away. As soon as the thief saw the police, he ran away. Combine the following sentences using to, to, so that not. He is ill. He cannot attend the class. Iron is heavy. I cannot lift it. So here two sentences to be used by using to, to, so that not. So let us use them. He is too ill to attend the class. He is so ill that he cannot attend the class. Iron is too heavy to lift it. Iron is so heavy that I cannot lift it. This is the way of using to, to, so that not. Now, rewrite into other degrees. No other city is as big as Mumbai. Let us compare them. Let us write it in comparative degree. Mumbai is bigger than any other city. Here, big becomes bigger. And you need to use comparative word than. Superlative. Mumbai is the biggest city. Very few flowers are as attractive as rose. Let us see the comparative degree of the same. Rose is more attractive than many other flowers. Taj Mahal is more beautiful 
than many other monomers. Let's see positive degree of the same. Very few monuments are as beautiful as Taj Mahal. Diamond is one of the costly stones. Let's see positive degree. Very few stones are as costly as diamond. And the comparative degree is diamond is costlier than many other stones. Now, change the following sentence into reported speech. Shanta said, the principal announced Dasra vacation yesterday. Shanta said that the principal had announced Dasra vacation the previous day. Here, the given sentence, that is reporting sentence is in past tense. The word announced is there. That's why we need to change it into past participle had announced. Yesterday becomes the previous day or the day before. Any one is correct. The king said, is there any evidence to prove yourself ignorant? This is interrogative question. Yes or no type. So you need to use whether. The king asked, whether there was any evidence to prove himself ignorant. Change the voice of the following. You need to change it into passive voice. The bill collector issued notice. Notice was issued by the bill collector. Doctor is operating the patient. So it is continuous sentence. The patient is being operated by the doctor. We have submitted all the documents. All the documents have been submitted by us. Now, observe the relationship in the first pair of words and complete the second pair accordingly. Honest, honesty, strong, write down in a notebook and wait for my answer. Man, common noun, kindness, dash. Shallow, deep, courage, dash. Dear, deep, fair, dash. So the answers are there before you. Strong, strength. Kindness, abstract noun, courage, covered, fair, fair, F-A-R-E. Pure, impure, appropriate, you need to write. Constitute, constitution, assist, dash. Mean, meant, fight, dash. Appropriate, inappropriate. Assist, assistance, fight, fought. Burn, burnt, spend, dash. Hope, hopeful, glory, dash. Eye disease, oculist, nose disease, dash. Answers are there before you. Spend, spent, glory, glorious, Nose diseases, a rhinologist. Potent, powerful, stupefied, dash. Pray, pray, get, dash. Young, youth, wise, dash. Let's see the answer. Stupefied, confused. Get, gate, gate here, the walking manner. Wise wisdom. Now we have reference to context taken from both prose and poetry. You want to draw water from the torrent. Dear students, you will have three marks here. This extract is taken from 
A Wrong Man in Worker's Paradise, written by Rabindranath Tagore. May, maybe the hair on my head were numbered. This is taken from The Gift of Magi. Della tells it to her husband. She looked down to blush and she looked up to sky. This is taken from the poem Lokinwar. God, we have not a moment to spare. Again, it is taken from The Wrong Man in Workers' Paradise. Please, God, make him think I am still pretty. The gift of Magi. Oh, come ye in peace here, or come ye in war. This is taken from the poem Lokin War. Let's move on. Time is a flying. The first lesson. Wrong man in workers paradise. You students, you need to answer all the reference to context. On this model, you prepare for tomorrow's exam. You will definitely score well. All the best. Thank you.